Actors could soon be joining writers on the picket lines as their contract deadline nears, although we are learning some top Hollywood players are working on a plan to call in federal mediators to avoid a SAG after strike. Meantime, the months-long writer strike continues with no end in sight. Eyewitness News reporter Rob Hayes has the latest from Burbank. More than two months into the Writers Guild strike and neither side has anything to write home about. But despite a lack of progress, WGA members and supporters still finding a reason to celebrate. Today, outside Warner Brothers Studio in Burbank, what organizers call an HBCU homecoming picket and rally. That meant a live DJ, step team performances, and several hundred picketers supporting the writers. WGA has always come out of the strike negotiations with a business in a better place. Of course, the clock is still ticking down to yet another possible strike. SAG, after his contract with the studios, expires tomorrow with no signs of progress yet. Well, the last time we saw two major unions on strike, both SAG and WGA, was in 1960. So that's a lifetime ago. Michael Schneider is the TV editor for Variety. He says today's Hollywood is in uncharted territory, that the studios may be able to withstand a double union strike situation for a while, but not indefinitely. We may be looking at uh, a dual strike uh, throughout the rest of the summer into September, and, and that's when you, you may see the, the real urgency to sit down and really hammer out new, new deals. One new development, the Alliance of Motion Picture and Television Producers today asked federal mediators to step in before the Actors Union decides on a strike. It's unknown if SAG-AFTRA would agree to the move. But as the writer's strike drags on and the actors inch closer to one, businesses surrounding the studios continue to brace for even more tough times. Family-owned Tools to Go caters to the studios and is now struggling to stay afloat. We have almost no business right now. Uh, we just have to weather the storm. It's like sitting in a cave, uh, waiting for it to end. Meantime, SAG after President Fran Drescher is catching heat from some members after spending the weekend in Italy at a ritzy high fashion event, even with the union just days away from a possible strike. Probably not the best optics, and I think everyone can agree that uh, it, 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 it is sort of an unprecedented time. Unprecedented maybe, but a time that is quickly ticking down to some widespread impacts. In Burbank, Rob Hayes, ABC7 Eyewitness News.